Well, this bill is, uh, we're putting this bill in place after speaking with multiple school districts, not only in my district, but throughout the state, talking about the fact that they're viewed as uh, a wealthy school district. When you actually look at the numbers, that school district um, is not uh, as, as wealthy as it may seem or well off as it may seem. And they're in a situation where they're trying to pass a levy um, when they're asking for, in some respects, 85 to 90 percent of, of the dollars uh, for new buildings to come from their local people. And it's so difficult to pass a levy these days, not only uh, at that level, but at the same time, we took away the state uh, portion uh, of those levies. So it's just a difficult sell all the way around. And these schools are in a position where they have uh, buildings that were built in the 20s and the 30s and that, are, and that are falling down. And so they're not able to pass levies at that level. So what we're doing is we're making this legislation would uh, start it at 75%. So the most a school district would have, or the most that the most that uh, the residents of that school district would have to pay is 75 percent uh, and the state would pay 25 percent and then it would be adjusted from there rather than starting at 100. At the same time we are um, putting the 12.5 percent back in from the state so that uh, some of the, so that it makes it a little bit easier to make that sell to your residents when you're trying to pass a levy.